Yo, 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 what's going on? What's going on, y'all? Hope y'all having a wonderful day today. Thank you for joining us on this wonderful uh, Saturday morning. The cartoons are a few, few. Right? We got a few of the homies here already. Right? Oh, my goodness. What's going on, Peach? How y'all doing today? Yo, it's another Saturday, bro. Waking up a little li- bit late today. Uh, I think we need a little bit rest, but shout out to everyone who's in the chat and, ch- and chilling with us, ready to engage with Netflix. Bro, it's been popping off in the streets uh, as usual. Every time I think it's a chill time and we're just gonna relax, <laughs> and like, all right, cool, we just get to wake up for Saturday morning. <laughs> Something always happens, bro. Something always happens. Like uh, we we were talking last night, and uh, it's like as much as I try and like not give uh, any credit to the evil people who are in power right now, uh, they're doing the work behind the scenes, bro, and they ain't stopping. <laughs> so, so, so we ain't stopping, bro. We ain't stopping, bro. But yo, uh, that's yeah. how I feel today. We're just here to k- continue what we're doing because uh, we ain't gonna stop. Facts, facts, facts. We got the homie Leon here. What's going on, Leon? How you feeling Leon. this wonderful Saturday morning, bro? I, like, it's always <laughs> good to have you here, bro. Much love. Oh, for sure. I appreciate it. You know, it's always love to the cool table. Um, I don't know what you're talking about, Austin, but I get what you're talking about. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, yeah. Leon, yeah. Leon. All right, can I can I fill the can I fill the homie in sky real quick? Hey, hey, it's just us three here anyway. Go ahead and fill the homie in. All right, right. it's just us talking here, bro. So yesterday, uh, it was seen online and pointed out that Zack Snyder's Justice League, that trailer, the Hallelujah trailer, had been taken off of YouTube. The one with like 31 million views, the most viewed trailer on their uh, YouTube channel, taken off of YouTube. And uh, it was wow. later it was later told to us via a Screen Rant article that it was due to music licensing issues. That's the reason that was given by Warner Brothers as, as far as why they took it down. Um, but obviously that article was really downplaying the potential of a sequel as well. So that was fun. Um, not to mention during the day, after that happened, right, before we were told the reasoning as to why they took it down, an, a separate event happened. So Zack Snyder's Justice League is taken off of YouTube, or the trailer, the Hallelujah trailer. And then, at outside the headquarters of Netflix in Hollywood, Sean Gunn was protesting with the uh, actors and writers who are outside of Netflix. And upon being acquired, he was, you know, why are you doing this, Sean? THR was reporting this, and they interviewed him. And he was mad about Gilmore Girls residuals. Okay? Let me sit, Let me just let that sink in, and you start to let your brain do some gears, all right? And if you're thinking, <laughs> if you're funny, thinking this, if you're thinking this, you're right. Gilmore Girls is owned. And By Warner WB. Brothers. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, a few people of uh, notability. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah. Leon ain't even having to know yeah, what he know. already knew. He already knew, bro. Oh, my. This is some wacky this shit, y'all. I love Leon, dude. That's why we love <laughs> Leon. Yo, so, I, I remember that stupid ass show being on the CW. Yes. Exactly. It. So he's outside so Netflix. Like, Hold on. So you're off outside of Netflix protesting a Warner Brothers product. Let me let me Hilarious. let me now. So that happened during the day yesterday, right? Oh, he left. Whoa, dude. He got so mad he rage quit. Come on, Leon. Come back, Leon. Nah, man. Hey, hey, ladies and gentlemen, they got it. You know what I'm saying, right? As soon as we start filling the homie in about this wackiness, right? Look what happened, <laughs> bro. Right? Hey, man. I was just about to fill him in. All right, what, what's the chat saying about all this? We gotta look at the chat now. Now it's not Uh-oh. just the three of us. <laughs> Yo, there he is. There he is. All right, Leon. They tried. To, they tried to take you out, bro. 
Oh no! I'm yeah, back. Hey, he's back. They tried, to get me. <laughs> they tried to get me. He's like fifty cent, bro. They can't put you down. <laughs> Nine shots. <laughs> <laughs> um, but so THR th- then this morning uh, did something and posted a tweet as to why they did something. And let me read you this tweet, my friend. A tweet featuring a video interview with Sean Gunn discussing his residuals from Gilmore Girls was removed because it did not note that the residuals Gunn was referencing are paid by the studio and not the streamer, Netflix. So THR took their own video down because of Sean Gunn's own misrepresentation and misinformation. How about that, bro? Shout out to THR, by the way. Good on you guys for doing that. But that's that's where we're at today. <laughs> that's what we're coming today's stream with. All right. Hey, but this is what we've wow. been dealing with, people. Right? That's I'm crazy. not shocked. Not surprised, right? And somebody correct me, this isn't even the first time that they took that trailer down, right? They just put it back up last time. And they took the same trailer right. down again. This just so happened to be Max's uh, largest viewed video on their channel. Yeah. Right. Right. Uh, and, you know, this is this is what we're dealing with, people. So this is why sale is the way. Obviously, the guns are triggered. Right. <laughs> like, I don't think that that was any accident that Sean Gunn was protesting in front of Netflix. Yo, we're getting into some wacky shit now, y'all. This is wacky. Right? The wackiest. <laughs> no, yeah, this is clearly some like matrix level bullshit, you know. That word's been going around a lot on the internet lately, thanks to a popular man that I'm not gonna name, but that matrix shit is definitely well, I, I should say hey. uh, infamous guy. I don't, I don't I know think, about popular. But I, I think we're we're the ones who sparked the popularity back up, bro. Let's be honest. Who started possibly, using possibly. who who started using all those neo clips recently, huh? <laughs> I feel you on that. I feel. Hey, you know what? L- l- fuck it. Syndicate Network will take it. <laughs> but like, there, there's something about these little details that occur uh, in the time frame in which they occur. Had this shit happened like five years ago, it's like whatever. But this is happening now around some of the most interesting buzz around Netflix. And all of a sudden, Netflix has become public enemy number one as far as media and entertainment. You notice that, right? With all these little protests yeah. and all these articles. Yeah. Oh, Netflix, 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 Netflix. I'm like, y'all motherfuckers ain't talking about nobody around <laughs> one of others protesting or any other studio protesting. Like every studio is has a protest, but for but we're talking about Netflix for some reason. I've always found that fascinating, but just never said it out loud. Now that you're talking they can, about like Disney. the Disney people is not protesting too, right? Like they yeah, protest yeah, pro- outside the of Disney. Disney. <laughs> Bro, and y'all remember, y'all remember even before these protests that were specific about the writers, there were protests about um the VFX people. VFX, right? Movie. So it's like, bro, there's always a protest, but now all of a sudden Netflix is the main focus. And listen, I'm not caping for a studio owing somebody money. If y'all owe people money, pay their ass. But what I'm saying is let's not try to pretend like right. there's only one evil evildoer here in this situation. And for that clown who likes to dress up as a weasel to go out there acting like acting like he's a... First of all, first of all, this is how you know it's bullshit. It's that dude. Right. Who the dude. hell gives a shit about his opinion? It's like you that were- Dave Chappelle uh, joke. Who the hell asked about Ja Rule? <laughs> Where's Ja? Where's Ja? Where's ja? <laughs> you feel me like, what? what Bro. is Sean Gunn's opinion? Who gives a fuck? Who gives a fuck, dude? You that, were just in Guardians of the Galaxy 3. Why are you worried about Gilmore Girls residuals? Did your brother not pay you enough? What the fuck? Well, well that and, again, on the flip side, I'm just going to emphasize this and I'm done. Who the, who the fuck gives a fuck about what the fuck Sean Gunn? Listen, if I go in the living room not right now and ask people, who's Sean Gunn? They're going to be like, what are you talking about? Okay, facts. You mean James Gunn? <laughs> They're not even going to say that. I guarantee you. I guarantee hey. you. If I go in there right now and be like, yo, y'all know who Sean Gunn is? Who? 
Who are you talking about? So that's exactly the reason why I'm wondering why anybody of note would walk up with a microphone and ask that clown anything. Who gives? Right. Who cares? That's that's such a big red flag in a setup, bro. It's a why setup, are you bro. out here, nobody actor? Why are you? <laughs> Like really? Because there's no there's no place else to work right now. Someone he's got to get paid to do something, bro. So that's what he did. And literally, uh, I mean, I didn't I didn't use. The, so here's how you do as people, by the way, if you're wondering how you can uh, let out your ag aggression online as part of this movement, don't use the hashtag. So I did it. I literally tweeted at Sean Gunn and was like, "Yo, this is a better performance than you did in the Stupefied Squad, at least. So congrats on you. Like, good for you, bro." But, and I didn't use the hashtags. That's following the ROEs. Don't use them. And and but literally, yes. That it's so it's so Weasley, Mama Bear. You're so right. It's such a good fit for him. And, and it's like, uh, how it it took you, <laughs> Leon, a smart a smart logical common sense man, two seconds. I literally and I gave you that time. Like let that. Let the gears start turning. And you're like, wow, what the hell? WB owns those rights. What is he doing over there? It's like, yeah, if you're an actor, you should know who does the payouts, right? You should know how you get paid. Like Sean Gunn's not that stupid. He knew he knew what he was doing. He did what he was told. In my opinion, that's how it looks. And that's exactly how it come off. I mean, and, that's and, the way and, it looked. <laughs> that, that's the way it looked to me. An emphasis on the fact that it's a setup. Like he yes. did what he was told and whoever interviewed him did what they were told because the dude is a nobody. It's nothing yes. personal. No one knows who the fuck this guy is. If it was Tom Cruise, if it was um Colin uh, Colin Farrell, like he went to the protest and it was like, a, oh my gosh, they like, they yeah, wanted yeah. to know everything he was doing. Mega stars, yeah. <laughs> right. There were like um, professional wrestlers that pop up at the protest. They get asked, like, who is Sean Gunn? Who cares? Like that was yeah. a total setup. And then yeah. if you're worth your weight and knowledge, if you got that microphone in your hand, you're gonna know automatically like, uh, you're here for what? Oh no, nah, that's that's Warner Brothers, bro. Yeah, dude, yeah. Are, aren't you, know you I mean? a reporter? Aren't you, if you're an actual journalist, you should do your own forethought and like, they should have, they should have, that's why I think it's hilarious that, uh, they even put it up to begin with. Like they knew what they were doing. They got their clicks. They got their, you know, they got their views that they wanted out of it, uh, and got their story. And then Bro. they took it down. Yeah, because that's the thing, more right? Important is the fact that now Netflix is looked at as a bad guy, at least right. for a day. Right. That's the only thing that's important to them. Yep. Right. And here's the thing also, right? Um, a lot of times if you can just put something out there, it can start kind of kind of taking legs and getting life of its own and then the retraction is never as big people will hear what you said and then never know that you even retracted your statement right yeah. so yep. uh yeah that's pretty much what that was with that i am sure that there are probably going to be other articles and people trying to um touch on this even after it's already been proven that um that's a wb owned into i mean property it's crazy yeah dude it's it's just hilarious that um that anybody else though um would think otherwise and but yeah you're so right though like the retraction is never as big we see that all the time um but i think i don't know i think for this people who don't know and maybe are just like well <laughs> for some reason see sean gunn and be like oh my god i can't believe netflix would do that uh I don't think there's many people who just take that as fact. I think a lot of people, and, and I saw it online even, like a lot of people were like, even though I know Twitter's not the majority, but um, they were all like, yo, this is blatantly out of place and Sean Gunn, you're an idiot. Like everyone was like that. Um, and so I don't, I don't think their mission was accomplished in my opinion. I think that it made them look worse and that's why they had THR take the video down. That, I think that's what really happened. Like they got they got caught red-handed, and then they asked THR to take the video down. Like, oh no, 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 take it down, take it down, take it down. <laughs> like they found that it out, they found us out. And and also, if you're wondering to yourself, well, why wouldn't if Shanga knew, which he did, 
that WB is the one who does the residuals. Why wouldn't he be over at WB protesting? Oh, right, because his brother works there. Like, that's why. <laughs> that's why he wasn't at WB. It's, it's pretty, well, like, straightforward. Thing, right? Yeah, exactly. His brother told him to go to Netflix. That's why he was at Netflix. Plain and simple. <laughs> yeah, this is just more reason why um, we've been stating that hashtag sale is the last way to go. Um, if you look at the behavior of this company that um, released the Snyder Cut, right? Ever since this film uh, has been greenlit, it has been a constant um, pushback from this entity, right? From leaking the movie out, hiding the numbers, um, just leaking the trailers out, right? Remember when that Dark Side and Steppenwolf thing got leaked out early, y'all? Y'all remember that? Yep. yep. Right? The movie being accidentally released early during Tom and Jerry. Right, like, you know, taking the trailer down, the cul-de-sac comments, taking the trailer down again, <laughs> right? Like, you know, um, at what point do we realize that it's best to just move on and focus with a new uh, third party and try to, you know, drive interest with them? Um, and, you know, I just think that these recent actions should only show more so that this is our last opportunity and WBD and DC Studios are not interested at all in the in um this thing changing platforms or getting a proper conclusion. Yeah, like yo, know, I would love to just be over here doing right, doing night shift or whatever, right? Talking about look, to be honest, the MCU and what is coming up in the future sounds way more interesting to me right now 100 oh, yeah. percent. and so uh what they're doing uh sounds way more intriguing what dc is doing with elseworlds sounds way more intriguing i'd rather just focus on that stuff um uh, and not even be having to have these conversations but look at what happens you know like you know whenever uh we try to just do our thing you gotta you know just when i think i'm out i know <laughs> <Exactly. Yeah. laughs> straight up dude straight up it's right. crazy it's crazy how it keeps happening um yeah, yeah I, I'm, I get exhausted myself all the time but it's just like man yeah gotta put the, we got to continue to put the work in I, because they're not going to stop and we can't stop because of it um it's crazy when you're fighting against a yeah. multi-billion dollar corporation. Uh, but if they keep the their ways up, they're not going to be a million dollar corporation, much less right? uh, any longer. And then, look, y'all, look, Austin kind of touched on it earlier because he was like, man, I wish I wouldn't have said what I said last night. You know what I'm saying? But it's like, nah, hey, y'all, <laughs> y'all have no idea, bro. It was crazy. Bro. I, I I I didn't see the strong good shit until afterwards. Like, oh my god, like, it's the same day. Like, you can't be more uh, more obvious of what your tactics are. Take down the Zack Snyder's Justice League trailer, and then go to Netflix and complain about bullshit that doesn't involve Netflix. Like, what are you guys doing, guns? You think that we're oblivious over here? You think that we think that you guys aren't trying to double team like all of us on the same side? Like, ah, we're gonna take down the Justice League trailer and we're gonna make Netflix look bad so that way we get them on both fronts. They love Netflix if we just make them look bad. Blah, 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 blah. It's like, good try, dude. Guess what? We're still on Netflix. I have Netflix pulled up right now and we're about so to watch I. it. Yeah. Hey, and they're give great. Us a thumbs up in the chat. Yeah. We are ready. season two, yeah. uh, episode one. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel about all this, man. It's like you continue, continue to do your dumb, oblivious, and obvious stuff. And we're going to continue to move forward with effectiveness and move forward in a way that is smart and thought through a while, bro. you know what i'm saying and and we're not gonna we're not gonna make rash decisions all the time and make stupid statements online that are 
clearly debunkable. Like, ah, oh, man. I, I can't like, believe he sent his baby brother to crash out, yo. That's oh, crazy. I'm not that's, surprised. That, I that's am, wild, yo. I surprised. would never. I am not surprised myself because he's not a genuine good human he, being. You know what's crazy? I almost got jumped one time and I was with my little brother. I like sent him home. I was like looking about to get in like a fight with like two dudes. I, I, I literally sent him run. I like, bro, run home right now. Run, yeah. Like, ain't no way, bro, I'm sending my little brother to crash out, bro. Un unreal, dude. And, and that's, that's crazy. I, that's, I, I, that's, that's wild, bro. Yeah. He's just, he's just a bad person, dude. He's just a bad anyway. person. Look, y'all, give us a thumbs up in the chat if you're ready. We on season two, episode one. I am Legion, right? I'm about to wait for these thumbs up real quick because, yeah. man, I, look, yo, you I'm the reason why I sent his brother to crash and burn is because he probably said, Listen, man, have you seen all the stuff that I've been through? This is nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bro. Hey, I mean, he's like, I failed upwards. As the kids say, <laughs> you can take it. Let's go to a measly little protest. It's fine. If you <laughs> it, it'll make you look good for the studios. So they'll do like, you know, he probably said something. Like, if you do this, I'll make sure I get you in Guardians of the Galaxy 4. Or he'll the, get him like, another <laughs> role. That's crazy, bro. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's what he keeps doing, dude. That's the only reason why Sean Gunn went to do this. Sean Gunn ain't knows damn people, well. Ain't, bro, he, he, ain't, ain't he two people in Creature Commandos? Yeah, he is exactly. Keep He's like, your I'll make job. you three people in future commandos if you do this. Um, it's just hilarious where everything is at right now as far as the DCU. And uh, man, I'm glad that we talked this long because we got somebody rose from the pits of hell to join us. And uh, I will fill them in if they need any filling in. Everybody in the chat, give me some flame emojis. We got the Lord of Darkness himself. What's good, Necro? Yeah. What's, What's going up? on, man? <laughs> <laughs> Morning, bro. How you doing? <laughs> Morning, bro. I had a party bro. last night on the internet. 666 subscribers on my Yay. channel. And now I've blown past it. Not that far, but I did. But anyway, yeah. Good times, good times. What's going on, man? Sorry, I'm uh, late Congrats. ass Necron today, but uh, nah, dude, you were up late. I it's saw all good, you, bro. That's I, why. That's why I was up late said, too. Nah, dude, you're gonna sleep in this weekend. <laughs> tried to wake up. <laughs> yeah, yeah tried wake to wake up. up. Yeah, dude, th did you? Uh, before we move on and start uh, Netflix real quick. Obviously, if you haven't, get your Netflix pulled up, homeboy. But um, yeah, Are you all in the middle of a show right now? No, no, no. We haven't okay, even started because we, we, okay, we've been yeah. going over what happened yesterday. And I, I wanted to ask you if you're updated on um, all the, the BS that occurred yesterday uh, online. No. Did you, were no. you aware that they took down the Sax Letters Justice League trailer, the Hollywood trailer? Oh, oh. I, I did see something about that. Oh, they oh. – you, you know me, I'm so out of the loop on that type of stuff, but um, I thought they were talking about in the past when they, they were screwing up. They did it again? They did it again. Exactly, yesterday. bro. That's exactly. my point. Like, this exactly. ain't even the first time they took the trailer down, bro. I we were referring to the old time, you know? I'm like, oh, nope. yeah, I remember that. And I scrolled on, you know, whatever. Goddamn <laughs> idiots. They did it again. <laughs> bro. Yo. So, so let me fill that's you like, in quick. That's like letting um, racist grandpa on, you know, the speaker, you know, after you know he's going to do something <laughs> stupid. He's he going to say it again. Like, oh, why would you give him the phone again, you idiot? <laughs> oh, you knew he was going to do that. Yeah. That's funny as shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's you know, like that one it? smart guy going, what the fuck did you give? I'm sorry. I got Why did you yeah, give him the phone again? You give him the microphone at the on. wedding. <laughs> yeah, uh, oh, I got something to say about this next time. So like, no, get him out of here. I'm sorry, wow, guys. He, to he told me he wouldn't. That. He promised he wouldn't say it this time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I hope uh, you're and... happy. not that I um, approve of this, blah, 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 blah. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> right. Like, but look, wow, what was their excuse? They're right down here. It so was, it was a, a it music was licensing. But yeah. it was the same excuse they used last time. 
right? I'm like, bro, hold up. So this project just, this is the only trailer with like some music that y'all just can't seem to keep the copyrights <laughs> like oh. valid for, right? Like, bro. it's crazy, bro. And let me tell wow. you one thing. Let the me tell you one problem. thing. Who isn't there people in charge of you know making sure all the licenses oh, are taken care oh, of? Oh, you know? let me let me say this. Okay, they know damn well what they're doing when they're music licensing stuff. And want to want to know how I know that? Post that I posted two to three years ago after the passing of Mac Miller, using his music. Last month, they took down those videos. Dub Warner brothers discovery music group took down your video because of copyright issues so the rights that they own aka mac miller's music they go after that but i guess if they don't own the rights or something they're gonna try and make up some some bs excuse but yeah they know damn well what they're doing they know damn well. why is that trailer still up on um that other youtube channel man right i didn't realize yeah, that millions of views. oh yeah i don't know it's the max version that's taken down which was the biggest trailer on their entire platform on yeah. on that youtube channel right yeah. so once again hmm? i was i was gonna say the only excuse that will fly for me is because that trailer is moving to another network and then right that's the only thing i can think only of. Excuse, <laughs> but we know that ain't yeah. you know, but okay so that's half the story that that's half the story neck oh, that's, more, yeah. that's, right. that's half of what happened yesterday let's get started man because like i'm down this rabbit hole this. yeah, yeah man, i had to send the fill I you in been talking right. about it yo no for I, look i'm all for filling in neck rhyme because that was wacky yeah, I right. I literally thought, wow, well, we're talking about that again. I didn't know they did it again. That's yeah, dude. Nah, nah, bro. I wanted to say earlier, somebody mentioned that uh I know this is random, but I just thought of it after seeing these all these villains. Somebody mentioned that James Gunn was the Joker of uh DC and DC fans. He's not, <laughs> he's the trickster. That's what he is. <laughs> For real. Oh, here we go. Uh, James we got James Gunn. Say now. Look, uh, we got a. Uh, JL, you watch along. We are currently <laughs> on episode five. Flash and Simpsons. Oh, and shout out to Mark Hamill. Oh, they yeah. yeah. Made, a legend. They made the trickster look like the trickster that he played in um, The Flash from the 90s, too. So, if you so look at the show. face. Yeah. yeah. He did come back and play him in The Flash series. Yep, and yeah. then he played him in The Flash series again. That's funny. They got the rogues sitting there having a conversation. Flashes, rogues. They're coming for you, Austin. You got your haters. <laughs> finally, <laughs> finally getting my museum. Yes. <laughs> Bro, they're the hardest <laughs> men in town. They just ordered Diet Cokes and freaking milk and shit. Come on, man. You're the hardest <laughs> man in town. At least one got an Arnold Palmer, you know. Yeah, I know, yeah. Wait, this is Austin's favorite episode? It's one of my favorite episodes for sure. It's the Flash episode, so it's 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 only under uh, the finale of last season. Mm. That'd be James Gunn in the boardroom. <laughs> you guys don't care about my sleep. <laughs> I don't care, you guys. <laughs> no, nobody gets me. <laughs> um. <sighs> hey, hey, would you guys please take it down a notch? Let me handle this. <laughs> James, you're off your meds, aren't you? Better off without them. 
Take him if I start. They call him him James. I know, dude. (laughs) That's too much. James, (laughs) you're off your meds, aren't you? We need to (laughs) click. I was, I was just as a joke. Yeah, I'm dead, bro. You got to clip bro. that, dude. You can make that a drop, Oh, James. shit. I drop just got caught up to that. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. What, is, what are the odds? <laughs> what are the fucking odds, man? Yes. James? What? <laughs> Oh, Yo, dude. come on, man. Hey, man, look, crazy. I'm out, so I'll get it y'all next time, bro. I can't even. I don't think I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> I've been going crazy. I need a minute, bro. I'll be back, bro. <laughs> That's too much. That is nuts. James, what, bro? Oh, What'd you just call him? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Yo. You can oh I gotta I'm clipping that too. Yes. My reaction, bro. Hey, you read my mind, Austin. You read my mind. You gotta clip that. Yo. Oh my god. How far are we into street 246? Oh my god, bro. James. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god Classic, you're off your meds again aren't you god. i'm better off without him i gotta go I got, oh my god the story writes itself bro we're, we are the matrix we're not in it we are the matrix <laughs> that was nuts yo the flash made a joke about the trickster and it happens to be legit <laughs> oh my god my head hurts. So oh, gonna... you know what, Austin? Yo. This whole thing, this whole thing we did was totally worth it. Totally worth it for a clip we're going to get from that Flash episode. <laughs> That was. Okay. I know. <laughs> That's hilarious. I wrote it down, bro. I wrote Perfect. it down. That, I can't that. believe that. That's what I'm. That's my. That's my next mission for tonight. Yeah, for real. Wait, they removed the Zack Snyder's Justice League review video from YouTube. Oh my god, man! Look, hey, I don't know. Man, this is the way. This is yeah. the way, yo. Everyone, have a great rest of your night. Uh, be on the lookout on different platforms for different things and obviously we're going to keep hashtagging as well so until next time be easy